our products have stories. It's not just taken from a product taken from out of the idea of another person or another tribe, but it really comes from the community. When you look at uh, products from indigenous tribe, uh, that's actually their culture and the, the values come in there. So weaving is passed on from generation to generation, even the, the designs. Because they say that the designs came from their God talking to them in their dreams and they just execute that. So now, if the weavers will not earn from the work that they do, they'd rather forget it and do other kinds of work. That's why we really need to preserve that weaving tradition. If weaving can really be a livelihood, then it can be preserved. It can only be a livelihood if people would patronize these products. If they'd say, oh, gawang katutubo lang yan. It's demeaning to the culture, to the people who were here before us. I think we really need to keep the traditions alive. We owe it to our forefathers. That's where the Philippines came about. Uh, we have our ancestors and they started the culture. And if we just look at what's out there and not look inside us, where will we be as a nation? Where will we be as a Filipino?